no note about yeah there it is Hannah Morse was Joey's favorite series of books when he was growing up we are not doing hot at all <laughs> these thick scarecrows some kind of carnival huh shall we look around how about I look around and you just stand here how about we continue speaking in the form of questions for the next hour quit blabbering go already oh he ruined it stupid toy. I want the train. That's the only train left. Do you want to exchange your prize for a teddy bear instead? No, I just want the train. Now, now, John. Don't make a scene. Joey won it fair and square, didn't he? But I won too. He just went first. <laughs> it's okay. I'll let you play with it too. See how nice your brother is, Johnny? Okay, you dumplings. Don't blot the stand now. Come, let's go see what's over there. I'm not a dumpling. You know what? I'm gonna call you dumpling from now on. You're bluffing. Ah uh, yes, fortunes of wonder are ahead of you. This one might just become a lawyer, and this one a doctor. Oh my. Come on, I'm getting both of you treats. Hey, where's my tip? No way, I ain't talking to her. Good or bad, I'd be screwed either way. I go then. You take a mallet and whack moles. Isn't that animal abuse? They're fake moles, butthead. It's how people blew off steam before FPS were invented. How primitive. Yeah, it's pretty ghetto. Where'd you read about it? My grandpa was a fan. Wanna play? Just hit everything on the head and you win? Yes, 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 yes! Um... Sure, why not? Play whack-a-mole. How's this gonna work? Um... That's it. That's all we're doing the rest of the day. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't get. 
Time's up. I probably would have hit higher if I had known it was just going to stand there. Well done. You earned 119 points. New record. You won first prize. For your efforts, you get a hamster trophy and platypus dolls. Well, Neil, are you ready to admit how good I am? I really love this, don't you? It's a totally unimpeded memento link. Shut up and give me my trophy. Gosh, dang it, these three bars. Fruits, fresh fruits. Apples, oranges, and tomatoes. We got it all. Wait a minute. Tomatoes aren't fruits. Er, yeah they are. They are the ovaries of the plant and contain seeds. That's what a fruit is. But come on, tomatoes? We never ever refer to them as fruits. We who? I happen to enjoy cooking in groups, okay? Some of us take it very seriously. Welcome, and behold, the world's smallest ferris wheel. Can we ride it? Absolutely not. Does it even work? Absolutely not. Looks well, like someone just glued some chairs to a water wheel. Don't know, don't care. Well, those, those two are... Mm-mm. I can never understand you, Joey. How can you stand the taste of them? They're just so sour and icky. Sour and awesome is what you mean. Just try it. Now I don't even want to taste regular olives. You should try at least one, Johnny. Who knows? Maybe you'll like it. Yeah. Nah. I'm done, though. Can I go play? Okay, but only at the playground, and not an inch too far. Just leave that bag. I'll keep it for you. No, it's mine. I want it. So, we're literally just going through and being like, nothing about... Johnny is Johnny. It's all just Joey. <laughs> oh boy. This is, uh... The implications of this are actually quite terrifying. Okay, decided to go farther than he should have, more than likely. Way to follow mom's orders, huh? Wow. 
slow. Well, okay, so we wandered off the trowel and found a cool place. Let's face it, he could have also been eaten by a pack of tigers. Tigers don't travel in packs, idiot. It was just an expression. You know, when I was a kid, my grandpa took me stargazing every year. Yeah? There was a hill outside of the city that we'd stay at. Same one every year. We'd watch the stars till daybreak. Well, I did, mostly. He just carried the telescope for me. Of course. The thing was, though, Ma didn't want me to stay up late. Grandpa always told her that we were just camping and hid the telescope inside the car. That's all good, but when we got back in the morning, I had to pretend like I'd actually slept. So in conclusion, that's the story of how I started my caffeine addiction. You're terrible. I do. It's a shame, though. All these nice memories, lost and never found. And who knows how many more like it. Well, as you say, just take it moment for moment, right? Mm-hmm. Ah, arr, I told you, packs of twat tigers dwell here. Huh. Hello. Wait, don't go. I'm Johnny. What's your name? You're at my spot. Your spot? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hog this place all to myself. Um, you want to join me? Are you here to watch the stars? Are you? Oh, okay. Just look at him. Did you know there were so many lights in the sky? Yes. Oh. Uh, I did too. You said this was your spot, right? Only during the carnival. Not a fan of the crowds? Me neither. You know, you still haven't told me your name yet. I'm not telling you. Everyone makes fun of it in school. Why? They say it makes them want to go to the washroom. Oh. Okay then. Well can't be worse than John. I mean, everywhere in the world, nearly everyone's named John. Even in India? Probably. Met enough of them on the line when they're telemarketing, so sure, why not? What's wrong with that? Hmm? What's wrong with having a name that everyone has? Well, it's boring, I guess. I mean, if everyone has it, then what's the point? I wouldn't mind. Just for once, to have the same name everyone else has? It's like those lights in the sky. They all look the same from here, but that doesn't make them any less pretty. Eh, I suppose. What do you think those stars up there are anyways? My dad said they're giant burning spheres of gas. Oh, I bet he's just making it up. Why would he lie to me? Because, you know, that's what grown-ups do. 
they make things up. Santa, Easter Bunny, kangaroos, stuff like that. Really now, Sean. Kangaroos are not... You know what? I ain't gonna even fault him. If I was told about this bipedal hopping machine monstrosity that was like, oh yeah, I put people in sleeper holds and also I punch stuff, I'd be like, that's not real. That's not real at all. Then <laughs> you'd just be like, it's from Australia, and be like, okay, yeah, it's real. Have you ever made an Easter Bunny out of stars? Like a constellation? Yes. Um, of other things. Never tried a rabbit, though. Do you want to make one? Yeah, we'll make the best constellation ever. Let's see who makes one out first. Okay, we'll start in three. Three, two, one, and start. I see it. <laughs> uh, where? In the sky. Um, but where in the sky? Think big. Huh? Bigger than all the others. I don't know. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I see it. Tell me what you see. There, right? There, there are the two ears and heads. What else? And there, there it's two feet. Yes, what else? And, and the moon. The moon is its big round belly. So, what do you think they really are? The stars, I mean. I... Never told anyone, but... I've always thought they were lighthouses. Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far end of the sky. Wow. It must be so lively up there. But it isn't. They can see all the other lighthouses out there and they want to talk to them. But they can't, because they're all too far apart to hear what the others are saying. All they can do is shine their lights from afar. So that's what they do. They shine their lights at the other lighthouses and at me. Why you? Because one day, I'm going to befriend one of them. That bag. What's in it? Oh, it's the prize I won from Whack-A-Mole. Did you get to play that game? I tried, but I'm too clumsy. What did you get from it? I got a thing. I don't know really know what it is. It's some kind of a weird duck beaver thing. May I see it? It looks so strange. I wish I could win one myself. Johnny? Hey, that's my mom calling. Here. You know what? Keep it. It's yours. Mine? Yeah, I can always get another. I don't like to brag, but I'm totally the best at that game. Will you be here next year? Yep. Will you? Yes. Same place, same time? Yes. What if you forget? Or get lost? Then we can always regroup on the moon, silly. Right on the rabbit's tummy. Johnny! Coming! Oh yeah, I forgot my hacky sack in the bag. You said you're clumsy, right? Maybe it'll help.
if they ever get lost. Wait, does that mean... Don't tell me you didn't see that coming. And here I thought this was going to be an inspirational childhood dream story. I should have known that some girl would come along and turn into a cheese fest. I suppose now we know what we must do to send him to the moon. Wait. You aren't actually going to do it, are you? It's our job, Neil. It's what we are contracted to do. Damn it, Eva. Wait. Eva. I know you're in here. Great, so... <laughs> Eva must be stopped. <laughs> what? <laughs> Where Johnny and River Archery Group, they get got lost from each other. Okay, but... Oh, we're not doing hot. <laughs> this is all your fault. I'm doing this for you, you artificially generated bastard. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> He's so upset. Where is she? <laughs> Where is this crazy woman? Not a platypus. Where is she? Usually I can't go through these areas, but okay. <laughs> oh, there she is. Turn around. Neil. I know what you're planning to do. I know that you know. Yeah, well I know that you know that I... Look, our contract has sent him to the moon. And the only way for that to happen is if Johnny is motivated to do so. But if that means removing River, then what's the point? The reason why he even wants to go to the moon in the first place is because she died. I know, but we are legally bound by the contract specifically. Ugh, the contract! I didn't take this job to make him miserable, Eva. I don't know about you, but I signed up to help the freaking geezers die happy. Me too, and I like this job. But if we directly go against our legal obligations, we'd be in court for hearings. We'll appeal. We know that Johnny would be happier to know not go to the moon. Johnny would be happier with a lot of alternate life tangents, Neil. We are not here to play God. Our job is to give him what he signed for. Well, we happen to know what he wants better than he does. Look, I'm only risking losing River because I believe in her. And what do you mean, risk? You're removing her. And besides, I will make up for it. Make up for it how? We're running out of time. Just trust me. Says the one who pushed me off the freaking lighthouse. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, oh, uh, no. Did you just? Freaking light data. Abusing your powers doesn't disable my controls entirely, Eva. Oh, now it's just creepy. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. First off, this room is blocked. What? Booby traps? Really, Eva? Just trying to buy some time. Gee, thanks for telling me.
when I find you. Those are some expensive piece of equipment you're tossing. Seriously, just stay put and wait till I'm done. Oh, piss off. Um. Look. Don't make me exit this whole thing and unplug you. Would you really risk distorting his memories as they are? Just stop trying, please. This won't take long. Ugh, not again. Or come and find me at the end of the hall. Oh, you've got to be freaking kidding. Is this a joke to you, Eva? Dear Lord, they aren't just zombie Evas. They're zombie Evas! Don't come closer. I got plants! I say to attack. Man, really? Yeah! Yeah! What in the world is this? <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> Are those spike plants? Or... What in the world is all this? Yo! I don't... I can still throw plants. Oh, oh, this one. What? What the? Eva? What happened? Eva? I'm not one to chase children in the dark because I'm terrified. What in the world? What else? Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far end of the sky. Now the whole construct's messed up. Oh. It's finished, River. She won't be alone anymore. I just, I just don't want to be another typical kid in a sea of typical people. What is it like? Just the responsibilities, I suppose. Okay. Why? <laughs> 
<laughs> There's the blue one. With its belly being the moon. Hello. Wait, don't go. I'm Johnny. What's your name? Your spot? Oh, I'm sorry. I mean to hog this place all for myself. Look, it was a long time ago. There's no date or time, Johnny. Hello, Neil? Morpheus? What? It's Eva, you idiot. No, we're the only ones here. <laughs> Listen, whatever you've been doing, stop it. We might not know what Johnny wants, but we know what he doesn't want. And what he doesn't want is exactly what you are accelerating. Sorry, done, Neil. Oh! Why don't you come out now? <laughs> 